Hi, welcome to Free Fiddle Lessons. Today we're going to learn the jig, the Lilting Banshee. It's an Irish jig uh, in A Dorian mode. So this is one of my favorite jigs, um, and I think it's really fun to play, and it's not too terribly hard. So um, um, I often play a D pickup note, though I don't have that notated in the music. So we'll just start. It's good to leave your first finger down there, um, even while you're crossing the A string. Here's the whole first phrase. Here again. And the second phrase. Just that much again. And then we do this little repeated figure on the A string and on the D string. So it's the same fingers on both strings. Let's do the whole second phrase now, starting on the A pickup note. And when people get confused in that second phrase, it's most likely coming back to that D. Um, Let's join the first two phrases. Uh, sorry, without the pickup note. And then we have the first phrase comes again. And the uh, ending starts the same as the second phrase. But ends. So the whole ending. So there's the double B there, which can maybe trip you up, but usually people get it um, with a little practice. Let's try the whole A part.
and then we repeat the A part. And I do sometimes play, I don't have it noted in the music, but a D as a transition note going into the A part. So you can do that if you like the sound of it. Uh, in the B part, we're also starting on A, but we're starting on high A through finger on the E string. So here's the first phrase of the B part. It's this big, beautiful descending phrase. And we're skipping over the C. Um, we also skip over the F, which in the case later on it's going to be um, an... Oh. I think it's going to be an F sharp, but maybe we don't actually have any of them. <laughs> oh yeah, there is one. There's one, two. Um, okay, sorry, I'm getting distracted. So that first phrase again. And then we have um, a second phrase that starts like the second phrase in the B part did. I mean in the A part. But this time it goes up. There's those F sharps. And sometimes rather than playing the G, F, G, I would play a roll, a G roll. I'll talk more in uh, about variation in jigs in an upcoming uh, lesson. But that's one, one thing that I might do in this tune. So let's play the second phrase of the B part. And going up. Let's do that again. Okay, let's start at the beginning of the B part, play the first two phrases. So we're starting on the high A. you could play that first phrase of the B part again as the third phrase, but I never do. I always play this variation. So it starts a little different. One more time. And then the ending. Familiar ending. So let's try the whole B part, starting on the high A. Okay, so let's play the whole tune. Two A parts, two B parts. <laughs> <laughs> 